Hello and welcome. Once again, this is Pure Graphics. In today's tutorial, I'll be showing you guys how to design a golden shirt or badge, however you want to call it, right here in Affinity Designer. It can be used for anniversary designs or whatever design you want to use it for. So let's get started. First, select the triangle tool and hold on shift and create, draw a perfect triangle right here and flip vertically and make sure you centralize it. Now convert to curves, convert to curves and hit A on your keyboard. Just make sure you select the center and you add a node there and hold on control and take it up a little. Now curve it down a little, curve down a little, take this out, take this out, out a little. Yeah, now you can give it a stroke and feel the stroke. Now go to swatches and select your gradient. I made this particular gradient for the sake of for the sake of this tutorial. You can make yours as well. Now you can increase the stroke waist to 20 or whatever however you want to make it. Centralized. Okay, now go to fill swatches and select 90% black. And go to select your rectangle tool and divide the shape. Remove stroke. Go to fill swatches and this time give it 100% black. Now you can take this, the rectangle inside the shape. And you can hit G on your keyboard and give it a gradient like so. Then it is a gradient and make it dark so that you have a blend right there. I think it's better this way. I don't know. However you want it. So now let's create a cycle. Now let's create a cycle. Hold on shift to make a perfect cycle. Now you can remove this through the fee color, the fill, remove the fill and give it a stroke of about one, however you want it. Now let's go ahead and pick up the tier two. Look at it, the tier two. Um hold and shift and make a perfect shape there. Try a perfect shape. Remove the stroke. Give it a feel, a gradient feel. Now you can take it to this place. Now you group the whole thing. Yeah, now you can group the whole thing. And make sure this is turned on. Th this must be turned on. Now you take this cycle in the middle here and bring it to the middle right here and hit ctrl j to duplicate it make sure you duplicate it and now go to this rotate here it's right down is zero but you can make it five something like five or seven like make it seven thereabout and hit enter now you can hit ctrl j to duplicate
and when you're done duplicating now you group everything you hold everything and group it together now we have to cut out part of this cycle so that we'll get what we want so hit p for the pen tool and draw a line like this you can draw a line like so and uh, now select the line and the cycle and go to layers and uh, expand stroke expand stroke now go to divide go to divide now the shape is divided you can delete this and delete this as well delete this delete this and group everything together and uh, you can hold on control and take it right here take it right here and take it down by hitting control by pressing control bracket you can use the bracket keys there to take it down and you can ungroup ungroup once again Here now we can group it back and copy it to the side. Group everything together once again and make sure you centralize it. Okay, now let's create something down here. Let's create a ribbon down here. Go ahead and select your rectangle to um, create a draw a rectangle right here, like so. Convert it to curve. Hit P. You can hit A also and add a node here load here take this up a little let's take this up a little take this down and take this down take this down now you can edit your gradient and make it look the way you want it to look I mean this is how I want it to look something like this Take it down. And remove the stroke. Take it down. Remove the stroke. 
I think that's our shirt. If you get any value here, you can go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so. Thank you.